thought you were going to do a flip on somebody in class. Johnny or someone. Go get a camera. Doubles. Right, whatever, you have five minutes. <laughs> I, uh, camp, video games, friends, and uh, that's about it. What else is there to do? Shoot heroin. Okay. <laughs> what kind of video games do you like to play? Uh, a lot of shooters, military games, uh, strategy games are one of my favorites, StarCraft, uh, maybe a... Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's a cool there. game, you've probably it's never heard there. of it before. This is like my video game stance, dude. All right. it's like this. Tell me about your hobbies. How old were you when you first got into video games? Four or five years old. I mean, it's been it's been a lifetime for me. I've, I've been playing video games my entire life, you know, since I was a kid. And you know, it just it just grows on you, and you just kind of sometimes just spirals out of control. I like to think I can make music, but uh, that's another story in itself. I like to build. Me and a few friends went over to his house, and you know, he had an N64 there, and he's like, "Hey, why don't we turn this thing on? Let's you know, let's play some let's play some video games." And I'm like. I don't know, this is cool, it's fun, he's, yeah. So, you know, we decided, we played it, you know, never stopped ever since. I mean, I've been playing video games for 10 years, 15 years of my life. I mean, nothing wrong with me. Think about it, I mean, without Google, we wouldn't be the same people we are today. I mean, our generation has been shaped by instantly answered questions, instantly found web pages, instant everything, the internet. And without Google, I don't think the effect would have been as dramatic. Like, think of the internet back before search engines. It's tough. You had to have the website to find it. Now you can just say, I want answers to my psych homework. And type in, like, the question, and it's there. The answer's right there. I mean, that's why Google's so amazing. I don't know. I'd say, uh, Daniel Craig. I mean, just answer the same question. Someone's got a man crush. He's a good Bond hero. Better than uh, Pierce Brosnan? Yeah, Pierce Brosnan looks like an it. He's just also cheesy. Maybe if he was in, like, a non-cheesy Bond movie, like Casino Royale was or Quantum of Solace, maybe he would perform better. But all the movies with him in it, he would just dodge bullets like The Matrix. People might say Facebook, but Facebook is downfall of the internet. Apps are the downfall of the internet. How so? Apps are killing it. Think about it. Think of how little people are actually visiting websites and just using the information from them. It's because of apps. And uh, I, Personally, I can't stand Apple, but that's a whole other story. I'm done. <laughs> no, no, one more, one more. Mr. Allen, my <laughs> flip was done. <laughs> Shire, I'm being really nice here when I say that this project was due last week. You I, know that, right? I, 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 I just had to smooth it out. I, I Seriously, understand. I just had to smooth I it out. Ex pack of excuses. It will work for me, but I'm trying to be like... Yes, you know how in like Macbeth, there's like ghosts that come and warn people? Yes. And throughout Shakespeare? I'm just trying to help you. So understand that... Hi. While these excuses will work here in this special environment called LTTV, when you get to college, you will be screwed! If you were to pick one guy that could kick Matt Damon's ass, who would it be? Me. What's my favorite website? Hmm. Friendster. Well, the man show is quite an oxymoron. Because <laughs> me and Aaron Sandoval are on it. I mean, we're not exactly macho by any means. Whoa, you know? whoa, 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 whoa. What are you implying? Um, I'm implying that the man show should be named the... I don't play anything to win. The androgynous mansion. <laughs>